Hello, I'm Printer Community. Uh, I just wanted to show you what I've been doing during the week. I have changed up my my way of working a little bit. So now you can see there's a, a weekly demo. Uh, a bit shorter, a bit quicker sprint I think is good for both me and uh, you. The goal was to finish the layout.scad and create a PDF, which is uh, the first demo then of course. And that PDF is this one. And uh, it's made to help people place out the parts much more easily. The, the most important thing is these screw holes. So you can you can pre screw all the holes and then remove this template and then just attach all the parts and they they should be already in the right place. Uh, might look very simple to make uh, just a PDF and uh, print it out, but this week's goal included also implicitly making all the parts good enough so that they won't change their they won't change their um, projection so that this uh, template won't change in the future so I had to decide on all the dimensions and like make test versions of all the parts like this the exact width here stuff like that uh, it took a week so it was a uh, good planning for one time sake we can take a look also at stretch goals because the first goal went so well stretch goal new spool with a line and contain mechanism mechanisms I can show you that also let's show it here in the same view uh, spools look like this now so the innermost part, let's see. So we have an innermost part, which you wrap the belt around. I have a printer running right now because the teeth are like point something millimeters off, so the, the belt doesn't wrap properly around it right now, but uh, still printing. The spools have got um, another diameter. The previous previous prototype had this diameter. The new one has a bigger diameter, which means less build up error, maybe faster moves, nicer parts. Um, and the contain mechanism that was the stretch goal is uh, this thing. You place the spool in like this. And it's supposed to, to keep the line from ever jumping out and tangling around here. And also never reach the motor so we get, so we avoid all those uh, dangerous situations. Yes, I guess that was it. Okay.